Welcome to another Factorio tutorial. Today I will talk about mining. If you like my tutorials, leave a like and subscribe. No, seriously, I can see you are not subscribing. So, let's get to basics. We will start with very classical mining. No, seriously, we will start with Bernetech. Usually, there are two schools for doing your mining operations. With coal, you attach the drill to another drill in a loop, so they will automatically replenish fuel. And with ores, you plop it right into the furnace. But, you can also use burner inserters to do fully automatic refueling of ore drills so that way you will be able to automate early game without electricity. Although it's more to flex on your friends than speed up your game. So, let's go to electric drills. This is where we can be a little bit more creative. Our setup will depend on how big coverage per drill is used we want. In simple terms, it means how fast we will mine our ore. With basic wooden pools, it can go with three ways. First one, a very compact, with usage of underground belts. It minimizes empty space to bare minimum, allowing for fast mining. You can also upgrade it with copper poles, so you will use much less underground belts, allowing you to save some iron. Then, you have this some sort of wider version of it, with poles not in the same straight light as belts. Also, this does not use any underground belts, so it is cheaper, but also slower a bit. Now, with third mining design, we can spread apart a little bit more our mines, so the radius of mining won't interfere with each other. Basically, that means slow output, but much less drills used, and that means much cheaper cost. Also, instead of belts, you can use logistic chests if your network is based on robots. There also can be UPS freaks that will use trains instead of belts or chests, but we will not talk about this madness. But don't leave the video yet. There is another mine you can consider in your base. You see, with enough underground belts, drills and bigger poles, you can push mine speed much further. Just copy pattern from the image and you are good to go. It's not that common design or at least I didn't see it yet. <laughs> 